Hey guys, it's Stacy with Misguided Road Trips, and tonight we are back at the Haunted Stables. Um, we came out here, we weren't planning on filming. We came out because Kylie, Patty's granddaughter, Patty's with me. Say hi, Patty. Hi, everybody. <laughs> Her granddaughter has leased a horse for the month to come riding here, so Patty called me and invited me to come up and spend time with them while they were um, riding the horse and all just for a few days. And we were on the live stream earlier with Clay, and I come outside. I don't know if y'all saw it or not, but I sent Patty a message in there to come out. I would come out to smoke a cigarette, and I looked off into the distance, and I saw what looked like shadows to be moving. Now, given where we're at, we've had this before. So I called Patty, and I was like, get out here. And she come out, and she saw them too. Later on, Kylie come out and also saw them. So there is something going on out here. We're not sure what. We weren't gonna film, but we decided since we all three saw something, it is a full moon tonight, that um, we'd set up the cameras and see what all was going on. So anyway, that is what road trip we are on tonight. I didn't show y'all this earlier, but these is what we've got going on down here. We've got the K2 meters. We've got three of them set up, so if anybody wants to come up and touch these, we'll know you're here. We'll feel your presence. Also, we've got the spirit box that we're going to do in a little while. Now, there are no horses out here, so we checked. They're all put up in the barn tonight that were in these pastures. And like I said earlier, it's a full moon. There's the moon. So, now, over here, in this section, right in here, is where we saw the shadows. We can't really get over to that because of the way the fences are. So we're about as close as we can get with the way they've got it corralled off and off for all the horses. I and mean, I'm sure there's probably a way, but we have no idea where the gates are. Now, if you remember... This land, and I don't know, some of you may not have seen my haunted um, stables video. If you haven't, you need to go check it out because it'll tell you a little bit more about the problems they're having here. I do want to let y'all know that Vanilla is doing a lot better. She's doing her spiritual healing still every morning. She gets to listen to her music, but um, they said she was back to being 100% Vanilla, so we're really happy about that. And I've seen her. She looks great. She's doing good. She's not nearly as skittish as she used to be. But, um, yeah, this land used to be Indian territory. And they have found genuine artifacts um, out here, arrowheads, different things that they have had experts look at. They know that this was Indian territory at one time. And um, we're not sure what tribe but we do know that you know the Native Americans did live here at one time and I can see why it's beautiful out here now is there anyone here that would like to speak to me You can speak into my camera and I will be able to hear you. Why is my light flashing? Guys, this is a brand new light. The one that I had when we went to Brushy, um, 
I don't know what happened to it. It quit working while we were at Brushy, and we could not get it to come back on no matter what we did. Tried to charge the battery, couldn't, it just wouldn't come back on, so I had to get a new light. And this was a really good light, but the battery's already starting to drain, which makes me wonder if we don't have some spiritual activity out here. I mean, I know we do. We've seen shadows, what look like shadows. I can't guarantee but definitely looked like shit. Hello? Is there someone out here? I could have swore I just heard something. There's someone with us. Can you tell me your name? Oh, it looks like somebody walking out there. That is what I'm talking about. I don't know if the camera's picking it up. I'm trying to get my light. It's... That is crazy. Would you like to come talk to us? Yeah, there's smoke and fog in the air. Who's with me? My name is Stacy. Can you say my name? Y'all, it is so misty and foggy. I wish y'all could tell. I don't, y'all can't tell, but. Okay, guys, right now we're inside the Airbnb where we're staying. I just wanted to show y'all this is where i have all my stuff charged i've got to change the light battery already so you see it's charged so i'm gonna put it in because this one has already died a lot of y'all ask me also what kind of headphones i use if I put it in the right way, it'd work better. These are the headphones right here that I use. They're Turtle Beach. I don't know if you can see that, but that's what they are, it's Turtle Beach. And they're awesome. Okay, so now, You're lighting. And it's on. I'm going to cut it off because spirits are draining it so fast. I'm, I'm pretty positive that's what that is. Also, I'm going to go ahead and change the batteries in my spirit box because they're already dead. I know that a lot of times it seems that um, we don't have our equipment function when we start, but in reality, we go through a ton of batteries. Came back over here and said,
sat down, guys, by the meters. Just looking to see if we see anything. There goes Patty. <laughs> I keep thinking I see something. I know. You too? Like, yep. I think, I think I see shadows. I'm hoping the camera's picking it up. I hope so too. I keep seeing stuff, but I caught something over that way mm -hmm. and looked like shadows, but I don't know if the camera caught it or not. You know, I can't wait to watch this footage. Oh, I know. I know. I just feel like something got here, and I felt like something was messing with my chair a little bit ago. Oh, really? Yeah, I felt like something was right, right beside me, and you were way over there. And I'm like, oh, oh, wow. So I got up, and I filmed the, the chair area. Yeah. So I could film the chair area, and I didn't see anything with my own eyes, but... Hmm. Yeah, hopefully I picked up something on You might have something, yeah. Huh. Oh. Guys, Patty's meter is just going off. Of course, now that I put the camera on it. I know. I turned my camera off too for a minute. My camera was off for a minute and the damn meter started going yeah, off. Yeah, we were going to get ready to do our spirit box and I looked over and it started going off. Can you touch it again? Oh, God, that was a bug. Oh. Ooh. Touch it again for us. Yeah, touch it again. Oh. <gasps> Mine just went off. That's that one right there, right? Yep. Oh, wow. It takes a lot to make that one go off, too. Yeah, it does. That one doesn't like to go off too much. That's strange. Just out of the blue like that. I haven't heard that thing go off at all. It doesn't normally go off too yeah, often. Yeah, I haven't heard it go off hardly at all when we filmed it. I have yep. the same one, and it really, it takes a lot to make it does, go off. It does take a lot. Mm -hmm. That's weird that the outside ones ended up taking on um, doing that, and now nothing. I know. Can you come back and touch these meters again? I think every time we put the camera on it, it stops. Come on, do it again. Make it go off again. Are you still here with us? Oh, look. Holy wow. God. Wow, they're all going off now. Okay, I believe that they're here. Yep. Do you want to communicate with us? Would you like us to turn the spirit box on? If so, make them go to red. Oh, Ooh. this one just went off. And you're at, now Look, yours are going off. They just went, oh, they just went to red. Oh, we need to do the spirit box. Oh, yeah, we need to turn the spirit box on for sure. Oh, that one's still flicking. Wow. They're going off. And there's nothing here to make no. them go off. The cameras do not make them go off. At least mine's never, never had. No, mine hadn't either. Look at that. That middle one's going... It goes just long enough to I swing the camera. Uh -huh. Are you camera shy? Oh, Which one of yeah. these is your Ooh, favorite? That one just blinked all the way to red. So you do want us to turn the spirit box on then, huh? Okay. Ooh. Okay. Oh. 
<laughs> I feel like I'm pulling that whack-a-mole game. I don't know which way to turn the camera. I know. Back. Oh my gosh. Wow. All right. Well, we should turn the spirit box on. They're yes. trying that hard to tell us to do that. Yeah. Definitely. So. All right. All right, we're going. Okay, guys, I got my equipment ready to do um, spirit box. I came back over to this corner because this is where I feel the majority of the presence. Even though the EMF meters were going off over there, Patty's sitting down by those. I came back over here. I brought my meter right there. And I'm going to set y'all down for just a second while I turn my spirit box on. Is there anyone here? My name is Stacy. I mean you no harm just come to talk to you and see if I can help you in any way. Can you tell me your name? Can you say my name? Did you live here? What keeps you here? like the horses? How many of you are here? Are you the one who affected Vanilla, the horse? Can you tell me your name? Can you tell me when you died? I'm sorry that you lost your life. Is that something that you're okay talking about? Can you, can you tell me? Nope. Can you tell me what happened to you? Is that you that's draining my battery? Why are you draining it? 
That's twice now, both of my batteries. You need energy? Why don't you come over and touch this meter for me? Are we safe out here? Can you tell me how old you are? I know it's dark, guys, but I really don't want to give up the spirit box session to go get the light changed out. Do you... Do you need any help? Can you tell me if there was a tribe of Indians that lived on this land? Are you still with me? What tribe were you associated with? Okay, well, I'm fixing to turn the spirit box off. I've got to go see if I can get another light. Thank you for talking to us. Bye. I hate to turn it off, especially when they're talking. It always seems like... Right as you go to turn off the spirit box, they decide to talk. All right, guys, second time my light has been drained already. I don't know if y'all can even see. Okay, guys, I went inside to change my battery in my spirit box, and when I come back out, Patty said that she was actually filming, and there are two horses out here she said it scared her because she didn't know if they were real or what they were at first but they are legit alive horses um so we may see them so we'll have to make sure that you know what we're looking at but that's not what we saw earlier the shadows that we saw was kind of floating across the ground so and I want to be able to show this to y'all. I want y'all to be able to see this. So, now I personally believe that spirits try not to get on camera. I've had them, and y'all know, y'all have seen on my EVPs, several times they'll say, cut off the camera, or the camera, or no camera, different things like that. So I think they try very hard not to be seen. But, you know, as a paranormal investigator, you try to catch them. And that's what we're trying to do tonight. So. It's so dark out here. Even with the full moon, it's dark. And I'm not sure. I think Patty said that the horses... We're out 
this way, but I'm not seeing them. But I'm not seeing them. Now this pen here ends. Let me show y'all. If the horses are in this pen, it goes to right there. That's the corner of it, and then the fence goes back. So anything farther out that way is not definitely not a horse. They don't have any horses out there under those trees. There goes my battery on my light again. That is so crazy that my battery is wanting to die. Who's out here with us? Who's draining my battery on my light? Can you say your name? I thought I heard footsteps, but could have been the horses. I don't know. I don't see them. Let's walk down this way and see if we can get an idea of where they're at. Trying to see if I can find the horses so I know where they're at. Oh wow, Patty just saw a shadow figure right next to her, y'all. I caught it on camera too. That is awesome. Yeah, so keep a lookout. They're moving around now. I think we're stirring them up. Yep. It was, it was you know that my light battery is already dying again? I see that blinking. Yep. What the hell is going on? I don't know. I even filmed myself changing the battery out. And it's been, what, all of 10 minutes? Yep. That is so crazy. Yep, fully charged. So, I know they're out here with us. They're definitely out here. I just seen a dark shadow right here next to me. That's amazing. Mm -hmm. Can you tell us your name? And we do have all the K2 meters lined up here. In fact, maybe I'll grab mine and walk around with it. And We'll see if we can pick anything up anywhere. It's wet from being on the ground. <laughs> <laughs> I had a bad storm here yesterday. Then it rained again today. If there's anyone with us, you can come touch this meter. And it will beep, make noises, light up, let us know that you're here. I'm going to come right over here, and I'm going to place it on this fence post. You don't have to be afraid. It won't hurt you, I promise. But if you come over and you touch it, it will light up and it'll let us know of your presence. What was that out there? I 
I thought I just saw something. Is there somebody with us? I'm telling y'all, I saw something move right around in there. I don't know where Patty saw these horses, but I am not seeing them. I wish I was, so I could tell y'all exactly where they're at. And she did come over this way too, so maybe they're in this. Who's with us? Who's with us? Yeah, I probably have to cut a lot of this out and only put in the sections that um, something actually happens because I'm not going to sit here and make y'all watch four hours of video while we sit out here and try to catch stuff. So I went inside and changed my battery. So my camera light is charged again. While I was gone, I just heard something. Hmm. While I was gone, Patty said she thought she saw something over this way. That's the barn that you see the light over there. That's where we were at last time we did the investigation. Uh, me and Patty both got a real uncomfortable feeling being out here just a few minutes ago. So Patty went ahead and lit some sage for us. So we have the sage burning. Still have the EMF meters going. And we're just kind of sitting here waiting to grab our cameras. Let me see something. There is something moving out there. I don't know if y'all can see it. But it looks almost like a white mist. I hope that shows up on the camera. Mm. 
Okay guys, it has been a long night. We have been out here about four hours and we hope we caught something. We're not sure. We gotta go back and look at the video as always. Y'all know how that goes, but um, we're both getting tired. Hadn't seen anything in the last little while, nothing on the EMF meters. So um, I think we're gonna go ahead and call it a night. I hope you enjoy the video. Uh, I know it's a little bit different than the norm, but that's all right. We like different. Hope y'all like different. So if you did, make sure you do all that YouTube stuff, guys. All right. Until next time, much love. Bye, guys.